everyone welcome back to my youtube channel my name is naninga koei thank you so much for clicking on this video so today we are going to do a makeup look uh, that is basically inspired by the caribbean nude makeup looks so i know i'm starting off with my concealer as you can see i normally use a concealer that is about three shades lighter and i always start off with my eye makeup The reason I normally use a, a concealer that is about three shades lighter than my natural skin tone on my eyes is because it makes the eyeshadow more visible. So I'll use a different concealer for my face, but for the eyes, I normally use a really light one. So for this step I'm basically using a brush to blend out the concealer that I've applied on my eyes. In this step, I'm just taking a beauty blender to try and blot out the excess. I'm just taking a silvery shade of eyeshadow and applying it to the crease of my eye. And then I'm just going to take a golden bronze color and applying it on my eyelids. Using a beauty blender, I'm just applying my foundation to the entire face. I'm now taking my concealer, another shade of concealer, not the same one that I used on my eyes and applying it um, in a triangular shape up along my nose and uh, across my eyes yeah, in a triangular shape. I'm also going to apply the concealer along the middle of my face as you're going to see in the next step. I'm taking a brush and just dabbing it or dabbing the concealer into my skin so that it can blend. Mm -hmm. 
and of course using a beauty blender to complete the look basically to finish off the excess and also to blend the makeup perfectly So I've just taken a powder brush and some loose powder and I'm applying it all over my face to set the concealer and the foundation. So as the loose powder is setting or baking basically, I'm going to apply the lipstick and I've just chosen a, a it's like a nude red, I don't know how to describe it, a brownish nude red. For this step I'm just taking a lip gloss and this lip, lip gloss has specks of bronze in it so you'll find like shimmery specks of gold and bronze inside it so that's the reason I'm picking this. We know that our people in the Caribbean do not love boring looks therefore if we're doing a nude look they love dramatic makeup, they love colors, they love so it's good to do a nude that is fun and to use some mascara to lift up those eyelashes. In this step I'm just removing my pressed powder making sure that it blends evenly and blends well into the skin all the way to my neck. Now over here I'm just contouring my nose, highlighting the parts that I need highlighted and I normally highlight my nose, my cheekbones, my, my lips, my, my chin, those are the areas that I normally highlight but you remember that you're supposed to highlight your face according to what you want and also according to the shape of your face so it's all these steps are basically your choice. It, there's no standard book about how you're supposed to highlight and contour.
we're going to put on some big butterfly eyelashes because the Caribbean people love their large massive eyelashes so we are going to do that I rarely have very long big butterfly lashes so I just picked the ones in my collection that are nearly big so they're not very big but you'll see that they are a bit prominent So this is my final look and I do feel that I could pass for somebody from the Caribbean islands. Thank you so much guys for watching. If you like this makeup look, make sure to give this video a thumbs up and make sure to subscribe to my channel for more content like this. I appreciate it so much for joining me. Uh, I'll see you in my next video. Make sure you stay safe, be blessed and be blessed and be blessed again.